where do I submit to be like, oh, I'm a, I'm an NFL free agent. Like, <laughs> I'm willing to work for a team, you know? Like, I'm willing right. to get signed to a team. How does that work where, like, teams will – obviously, like, I, teams will look at colleges and recruit mm-hmm. guys that way and look at them to draft them right. and whatnot. But when it comes to, like, becoming a free agent yourself and then right. kind of doing – you know, figuring out workouts and finding that out, how does – how does that whole thing play out well ultimately uh the agent is the one who does the connecting you know it's it's the agent's job to present you with the opportunity it's the athlete's job to take advantage of the opportunity so it's like Mm -hmm. a two-way street yeah whereas though like the agent you know it's like all right i trust my client i know my client is doing this and you know he's like all right you're doing this you're doing that and then he's negotiating and talking to teams trying to see where you can get a feel and it's, it's it's almost like a game of chess you know, and I feel like a lot of people, when they watch the game of football, they're looking at, oh, the ball's there, the ball's there, oh, that guy's running the ball. No, nah, it's really an art to the game. Yeah. Whereas, though, it's like you got to know your piece. You know what I mean? Like, for instance, like a, a bishop can move diagonally, you know, and that's that's that piece's role, you know. And if you find your piece and you know what you can add to a team, yeah. that more than likely will put you in the best position possible. And teams are looking for those pieces because it's like, okay, what asset does this person have? And they take those little assets and then they see if they can maneuver them to their game. Yeah, that know? makes sense, especially because especially with football, there's so many different moving right. pieces where it's like, I mean, at, at any given time, there's 22 people on the field. You know, right. that's, that's And a lot of these people are doing different different things. Uh-huh. So it, it, <laughs> I, I definitely, that makes sense. And I think the chess is a, is a good analogy of that. Um, we've got we've got here in the comments. What NFL team has he played for? Well, you're currently in the process of figuring I'm stuff in out. The process so we'll of working can't can't that. really talk about all that, Kev. <laughs> but um, thanks for thanks for the question, Kev. So this is uh, probably the last question on the on the NFL stuff that I want to ask you. But what's like the step by step? You could bring me through like if when you do do an interview, not <laughs> right. an interview, when you do a workout, like, a workout, like, like okay. you go to work out with the team. You don't have to mm-hmm. name teams or anything like that. But like, what is that? What is that process? Is that you know your agents like, hey, we got a workout you're gonna <laughs> do this time and day, and then right. just take me through that. What does that look like? So I'll I'll uh, explain um, an experience with the team. I'm not gonna release that team, but um, mm-hmm. so you know, got the call. Hey, we seen your film. We like this. Uh, are you in shape? Are you available? Mm-hmm. Yes and yes, obviously. I mean, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm available. <laughs> fuck yeah. So they bring you in. The, obviously, I'll bring you like the night before, mm-hmm. um, put you up like you know like hotel or housing, yeah. feed you. Um, then you just wake up early in the morning. They'll come scoop you, and then um, you just go to the facility, and they have like a, a list of things that they'll do for you. It's more than like like combine training. Okay. So you probably run first thing they normally do is probably have you run a forty. Okay. More likely two forties. First really? was good. You probably like right, I'm good, but <laughs> and they got you the second one to make sure you you, you right. like you let everything go and you're mm-hmm. like oh I'm loose now and they're like they're like no we need you to do another one actually <laughs> that's funny but um once you do that they'll time you and stuff like that and you get those times probably check your agility mm-hmm. it depends on the position you play too as well me yeah. as a receiver you know we kind of like the, the the runners like the gazelles like yeah. you know what I'm saying so. Um, they'll test you in your positional drills. For me, it's probably like change of direction, uh, running routes, see how your hand-eye coordination is, stuff of that sort. And they will try to tire you out. So if there's anyone that's uh, watching this video and y'all trying to get to that level, make sure you're in shape. That's yeah. number one. And obviously, your best ability is availability. So you got to keep up with your body and make sure you know all of the tangible things. And one thing that I do want to say is like, you know, um, the true test of a real man's character is what you're doing when no one's looking. So, like, you always got to stay on your P's and Q's, and you always got to do the little things because the little things are going to lead up. up to the bigger things. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. just just being mentally, physically, and spiritually ready, and then, you know, um, just be prepared for it because you just never know when it's going to come. Like, shoot, there's stories where it's guys where – Victor Cruz, for instance, he's working at a grocery store. Oh, got a call. Boom, he out of there. You know what I'm saying? Like it, it's crazy. Yeah, it, that's how it is, man. It's always that next man up mentality. So you could be that next man. So you just got to really hone into it. And you can't cheat the grind because the grind will it'll catch up to you eventually. Yeah. Thanks for watching that last video, guys. Click right over here to see the episode in its entirety. Or click over here to subscribe and check out all the other cool shit we have on the channel. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Do it.